A lot of new information tonight about this former Phoenix police officer. A la Bartley resigned from the department after he was arrested back in April. According to his indictment, he's accused of repeatedly exchanging pictures of child porn over several years. And in 2019, he was accused of trying to take sexually explicit pictures of a 15-year-old girl in a bathroom. A judge has ordered that he stay in jail until his trial. Tonight, we're also learning the Phoenix Police Department has identified cases for review dating back to 2008 when he was one of the initial responding officers. They're also working with the county attorney's office to review cases that were submitted to them. The police, sworn to protect and serve, but what happens when those sworn to uphold the law become the lawbreakers? It's a terrifying reality that has plagued communities for far too long. Across America, individuals with questionable qualifications and even more questionable morals have infiltrated police departments. These are not just a few bad apples. These are individuals who exploit their power, operating above the law they are meant to enforce. These officers engage in behavior ranging from petty theft and corruption to excessive force and even murder. They operate with impunity, shielded by a culture of silence known as the Blue Wall. This unwritten code demands loyalty to fellow officers, even at the expense of justice. It discourages whistleblowers and protects those who abuse their power. The result? A system where bad cops flourish and communities suffer. This is not an attack on all police officers. There are countless brave and honorable men and women who wear the badge with integrity. They put their lives on the line every day to keep our communities safe. But the actions of the corrupt few tarnish the reputation of the many. They erode public trust and make it harder for good officers to do their jobs. We must break down the blue wall of silence and hold all officers accountable for their actions. Thank you.